Hey, hi again. So, this is uh, Fixie Build Part 3, Take 2. Um, I have no luck with this technology stuff. Um, run out of room on my iPhone. So, speaking of which, um, I really need to get myself a decent camera for doing this on. So, if anyone can recommend me or recommend to me a good little camera for vlogging, please do. And um, if anyone's got any comments on uh, Windows Live Movie Maker as well, I'd be very interested to hear. Um, I just find it a little glitchy, a little limited. Um, there must be an easier way, so please do. And don't say buy a Mac. Or, you know, If you want to say buy a Mac, say buy a Mac, but you can't afford to buy a Mac. So if anyone's got any good solutions for um, PC and Windows, that doesn't encompass Windows Live Movie Maker, please tell me. Um, so it's Tuesday night, I've just been out for a ride with a group of guys. A um, group of guys varies every Tuesday, but it's normally me and um, a guy called Peter and a few other guys that, that come out. Um, a lot of these guys do like triathlon, um, they run together, etc. But I only go out for the for the cycling part of it because that's the only part I'm interested in. Before work this morning, I ran out and um, did a little bit more painting um, on the bike, um, which is quite often the best way. Really, you know, don't set aside a whole day to go out and paint your bike because it just won't work. You need to apply light regular coats, I guess. So I'm on doing the forks, as you know, at the minute. We've just polished them. Uh, we've masked them up and um, applied the primer, applied the primer like over the course of three days, I think. So one light coat to start with, let it dry for 24 hours, sanded it back to get rid of the imperfections. Um, so I've gone with quite an interesting colour, um, as you know, um, by my daughter's horizon, which you've seen. Um, I don't like dull colours, so I've gone with, let me see, if you can just see it on the screen, there. I believe you call that signal green, signal green. Here we are guys, ready to spray, masked off the tips and the lugs. I got in here with a Stanley knife and just cut away the detail. Both sides. Left under there clear so we can spray it so it won't rust up. And we've got the tips done. So all I'm going to do now is degrease the main blade just to get them nice and clean. And then we're going to spray. Okay, take a look at this. So, before, as in yesterday, we primed the forks and what we have here is a nice neat even coat of primer. All that's left to do now is to just want to take a few of these rough edges off with the with some uh, wet and dry sandpaper some of the blemish here and then we're ready to apply first coat of paint So we've decided on this, 
signal green. Trust me, I know where I'm going with this one. Even if you don't share my vision, I think it's going to look good. Okay, so that's basically all there is to it after you've applied this coat. Um, you want maybe want to sand back any blemishes again um, and just building up your coat slightly as I'm doing here, no different. Okay, thank you for watching. Join me in part four when we'll be um, unveiling the forks, removing all that um, masking tape and applying the finishing coat of lacquer. See you later.